Hello everyone, it's Helder here from uh, Natural Training Center. Uh, today I wanted to talk to you about this uh, Buck Hunter 110 folding knife. Uh, once again, many people know and are aware of this knife. It's uh, basically a, uh, they bill it, or Buck Knives bills it as a, uh, an American icon. And I kind of have to agree with that. So this is more of a uh, testimony than it is uh, an actual review. I have had this knife, my dad uh, gave me this knife when I was in the Boy Scouts, so it was a very, very, very big deal for me. You know, it was almost like a uh, rite of passage uh, from, uh, you know, a boy to, to man. So it really has a, a lot of nostalgia and certainly means a lot to me. But uh, as far as for you, uh, the great thing to know about it is that I've had this, uh, this knife for uh, over 30 years. All right, so you could tell by the blade, uh, it's been sharpened both when I uh, didn't know what I was doing and uh, years after, all right? So it's held up, it stood the test of time. I mean, just an excellent blade, especially if you're uh, gonna present it to somebody as their first blade. So this uh, buck knife is my go-to knife while I'm in the field. Uh, this is what I'll keep uh, on my belt, has this uh, quality leather sheet that uh, has also uh, stood the uh, test of time. And uh, the reason why I like it is I could kind of just uh, use it for whatever and not have to think about being delicate or it not being pretty anymore. All right, just the fact that it's been uh, through so much with me and so many memories and so many adventures and all that other stuff, um, I just uh, know its credibility. All right, and uh, once again, the length of time that I have had that, uh, had it with the active lifestyle, could kind of uh, prove that to you. While I'm in the field, of course, I have my Leatherman tool. It's uh, in my pack. And once again, I think about it as a tool kit. All right, just like my regular tool kit that I have at home, you know, you keep that in there because it has the extras in it. This one I'd keep on my person because it's something that I'm gonna use constantly. Almost the same way that we would have our power drill on us while we're doing uh, jobs around the house. You'll have your tool kit staged on the side, but you have the, uh, the trusty drill bit or hammer, you know, pretty much on your person or on your tool belt. All right, so very similar uh, scenario. Many state laws, uh, let's say require that your folder be under four inches as far as the blade. So it does meet that criteria. Uh, as far as everyday carries, this wouldn't be my go-to, all right? But if you are trying to be a bit more uh, covert or a bit more tactical, if we're out in these areas that, uh, you know, do not want us to have anything on us, all right, if I have my everyday carry, let's say zero tolerance blade, still under four inches, right? But if you get questioned, if you get stopped, if you're trying to fly under the radar, this is probably not what you want to uh, show when you're being questioned. All right, where this one kind of slips under the radar, everybody had it through the Boy Scouts, everybody's aware of it, uh, hunters, so on and so forth, every magazine uh, while we were growing up, you know, all of these other things. So just something else to consider. You know, we want to be smart, we want to accomplish our mission, and we don't want to get involved in politics while we are doing that. All right, so not much more that I can say about this uh, buck folder that hasn't been said, you know, hundreds of times already. All right, so uh, made in the USA, quality locking mechanisms awesome 420 steel so uh, if you're looking for something that you're most likely going to keep a lifetime uh, something that's go to um, something that won't fail you all right because of the quality uh, then uh, I definitely suggest of course to uh, add one of these uh, to your arsenal so to speak all right any questions uh, just post them below be more than happy to share anything else that I can with you and uh, hope that you enjoyed this review.